question number seven. So this one at the attention. So the figure shows a four kilogram block hang by two light strings. So there's two light strings. So what does this tell us is there is let me just um, there is uh, two different strings. Uh, there are not the that are not the same. They don't have the same tension. Uh. Okay, so let's draw a uh let's draw a what do i call this a free body diagram sorry okay now i'm just gonna start with my x and y axis so i have the weight which is w okay and then we have actually the free body diagram is already there okay we have w we have tension 2 sorry it's my cat uh, Okay, and then we have T1, tension 1. Okay, so the 60 degree is at this place here. La. Okay, so it, this one is weight, mg. It's given here, so that they check up the W, ni T2, ni T1. Okay, so this is 60 degree, this is T1, this is T2. Okay, right, if you hear my cat punya purring it's because he is on my ipad now okay all right now what is the tension in each string now for this case we have to consider both the x and y component lah. so this one is in equilibrium so this is newton's first law equation so total force at x is equal to zero and total force at y is also equal to zero so now first let's look at the x component so we have t2 and t1 which is in the x component so for t1 uh, for t2 it is going to the right so it is positive t1 on the other hand is pointing to the left so it will be minus t1 cos 60 degree equal to zero okay okay so in this case uh t2 will be equal to t1 cos 60 degree so this is our first equation now let's look at the y component as well so for the y component uh, anything that's pointing up will be positive and anything anything that's pointing down will be negative so this one will be positive t1 times with sine 60 degree minus with mg do we have anything else no we only have that so this one we can just directly get the tension for the first tension the first tension being a string, so this is T1 equal to uh, mg divided by sine 60 degree. Oh my god, why is it 660? Sine 60 degree. Okay, uh, so you will get the first tension, so that is 4 kilogram 9.81 divided by sine 60 degree okay so t1 will be equal to 45.3 newton so we can substitute actually this equation uh, substitute t1 into equation one you will get then the the tension in the second string uh, so that is 45.3 times with cos 60 degree you will then get the tension in the second string to be equal to 22.7 newton Okay, so that is the solution for question number 7.